Hi everybody! New features for 3D has now been introduced into PCB Editor. When you open 3D, there is a new interface where you can choose which objects you want to see in the 3D canvas. It is possible to choose whether you want to see all layers or you just want to see the outer layers. Select OK to see your board in a 3D view. If I select an object on the canvas, the original method highlights the selected object in red, as shown here. From Setup, select Preferences, and now select Highlighting. So here, two highlighting modes has been added, which is called Vanish and Dim. If I, for example, select the Dim mode, so everything on the canvas, besides for the selected part, becomes dim, as seen here. The dim intensity can also be controlled from the slide bar down below from 0 to 100%. The second one is vanish. Whenever this is selected, everything will vanish besides for the selected object. This could also be used with the second feature that is added, which is net pane. All the net information is brought into the 3D canvas. We can see this with the net panes dialog right here. The default selection shows all nets, which is 374. The drop down can be used to select other subnets, such as buses, differential pairs, match groups, and so on. If I, for example, select differential pair, you can see all the differential pairs shown in a list. Inside this, we have the nets. I can, for example, select a net as shown here. And you can see that it is shown on the 3D canvas. You can deselect everything simply by left clicking outside on the canvas. And you can then highlight other objects by simply selecting them. To give an example on the net, we could for example see one of the power nets. This could be 3.3 volt. One of the good reasons for using this feature is to measure from one point to another point in a 3D space. If you're interested in more ORCID and ALECO videos, then subscribe to our YouTube channel where we upload videos continuously. Thank you for watching.